So there we were, wheel to wheel, with the nastiest racing cars I've ever seen. Razor sharp chrome gleaming in the dark. Weapons bristling under rumbling hoods. Oh, the Cry City Welcoming Committee. Have a drink, friend. Yeah, well, whoever they were, they messed with the wrong racers. Jack and I are world famous. And we're connected, too. We've been, thanks, invited to Cry City for the reading of some will. A rich guy named Crew. The big gang lord? Yeah, big is right. We were crew's muscle in Haven City, but old tub of butter kicked the bucket. Anyway, where was I? Oh, yeah! Slowly, the racers circled us. The smell of fear hung in the air. And the smell of something else, too. I told Jack, close the socket! Sounds like this city's terribly dangerous. Maybe we should get law enforcement to crack down. <laughs> yeah, well, this place don't scare us. No nasty gang is gonna get us to turn tail and run. Sounds like they had you dead to rights. How did you survive? able to handle himself, but with my help, we took them all out, until only one was left. Really? You know, people in this town have a way of getting in over their heads. Like at the bottom of the ocean. Eh, easy, boys. My story's almost over. Yes, it is. Wait a minute, it gets better. Really? Dex, get in the car! Jack! Are you crazy? You ruined my story! Now! Ah! What are you waiting for? Step on it, Jack! I told you not to go out. We're getting death threats, Dax. Someone doesn't want us here. You think? I say we take the next boat home. Not a chance. Hang on! Jack! Hello everyone, this is Neronium. Welcome to my newest playthrough of Jack X Combat Racing. Jack X Combat Racing was created and developed by Naughty Dog, published in 2005 for the PlayStation 2 with some pretty bad bugs. Later on, in 2006, a Greatest Hits version was released, and with that Greatest Hits version, sometimes the bug would go away. In 2017, the game was ported over to the PlayStation 4 along with Jack 2 and 3. And in modern times now, 2024, the game is backwards compatible playable on the PlayStation 5 along with the rest of the Jack and Daxter trilogy, including the last Jack and Daxter game ever released, Jack and Daxter The Lost Frontier. I don't think I'm ever going to do Lost Frontier because I'm not a fan of that game. But, what is my history with Jack X Combat Racing? I got Jack X Combat Racing in 2006, unbeknownst to me of the dreaded save bug. What is the save bug? Basically, in the PS2 versions of Jack X Combat Racing, there's a chance that your memory card could get corrupted with corrupted data because of Jack X Combat Racing and how it was programmed. 
The bug was supposedly squashed in the Greatest Hits version, which is the 2.0 version, which is the version I am playing. Uh, the 44 minutes that's taken me to record this episode zero leads me to believe otherwise. Now, there are some external factors I'll get into later, but let's see if we're graced with this. Please insert a memory card containing Jack X game data. I think, let me see, which memory card is loaded right now? I have a memory card Pro 2, so... If I can get the darn thing to load, which I don't think it is... Oh boy. I think my memory card Pro 2 got messed up. Because my web interface is not showing up on the memory card pro 2 okay we have reloaded the card already off to a great start on this project i will say 10 out of 10. there's my profile okay so the key is every time i start up the game make sure that i don't have the memory card plugged in gotcha all right, let's set everything up. I wish you could save this to default, but you can't. All right. So what's my history with Jack X Combat Racing overall now that we've gotten the save bug addressed? Jack X Combat Racing was an interesting game for me. The only other kart racers I really played were Mario Kart Double Dash at the time and Crash Team Racing, which was also developed by Naughty Dog. Which is why I'm still upset to this day we have not gotten uncarded. <sighs> yeah, I could have had something going there, Naughty Dog. Never mind you releasing the same game multiple times. But, I played this game all the way to completion, and the cool part about Jack X is that there are a lot of different modes for this game. You have Adventure, which is what we're going to be playing for this project. You have Exhibition, which are basically the multiplayer mode, which this game could actually go online or do a LAN connection, being one of the few games that could do a LAN connection. It's interesting, though, because Jack X was developed around the gameplay of Jack 3's car mechanics. Which, it was weird, because both Insomniac and Naughty Dog followed the same thing of, Hey, people like this aspect of something from our last game. In the case of Jack and Daxter, it was the cars in Jack 3, so thus Jack X Combat Racing came to be. And for Ratchet and Clank, it was the expanded upon arena, which ended up becoming Ratchet Deadlock. Speaking of those, if you have data on your memory card for certain games, you can unlock secret characters. For example, scanning PSP and PS2. Come on, let's do this. If you have Ratchet Deadlocked data on your memory card, you can get Ratchet from Ratchet Deadlocked. If you have Jack and Daxter the Precursor Legacy data, you can get Jack from Jack 1. I do have other data for um, for Jack 2 and Jack 3, actually. Let's see if we can actually get that working real quick. I passed it. Let's get all the characters. And there is one for Daxter, too. If you have connected your PSP to the Jack X Combat Racing PS2, you will get the characters from Daxter in this game. Which... Autosave has been disabled. Yes. Right, so let's do Jack 2. We got Jack. We got Jack 2 Jack. And let us see. Where is my memory card with Jack 3? 
I don't think I've ever booted up Jack 3 on this, so I don't think I have any. Which is fine by me. Alright, so let us mount. Alright. And let us try and save again. I fear. Alright. All right. So how will we be handling Jack X combat racing? We'll be handling it like on pins and needles because I wanted to do the PS2 version because it's the version I grew up with. Even though the PS4 version is arguably the better version by simple virtue of the fact that there is no save bug in that version of the game. There was a game-breaking glitch inside that version of the game in version 1.0.3. But that's been patched out at this point, luckily. This game is just cursed. But we'll be just playing through the adventure mode of Jack X Combat Racing, having fun racing to the death against many other combatants. This is actually kind of a long game. And you have a lot of customization you can do. You can customize your vehicle. So we got the Road Blade and we got the Basher. Both of which are um, the default cars. So we'll start with that. You can tune the performance. You can get more for your engine, more for the gearbox, more for the armor, and more for the turbo. You're going to want armor, let me tell you. Otherwise, you blow up like crazy. You can get new parts, new fenders. You can get... Uh, new wheels, new drivers, panel, side roof. You can respray, which is cool because it uses uh, these little color wheel sort of thing. In fact, uh, I'm going to go with blue. Okay, and we'll go with purple. There we go. And then you can get a little accessories too. You can get antennas, you can get helmets. Uh, you get a bunch of unique stuff in this game and it's really cool. Sadly, you can't use the exhibition characters like the extra characters in the story mode, but you have a wide variety of characters you can use in the story mode. Obviously, I'm gonna be using Jack the entire time because the story's gonna revolve around him. But anyway, everyone, I'm gonna end it off right here. This has been Neuronium. And I welcome you all to Jack X Combat Racing. Remind me in every time whenever I'm going to be doing a recording session for this to remove my memory card before I start playing the game. And only insert it when I wish to save. So, I'll see you all next time. Hey, thanks for watching. If you want to check out more Jack and Daxter content, check out the top link for a playthrough of Jack 3, done on the PlayStation 2. And if you want to see another racing game by Naughty Dog, check out the bottom link for Crash Team Racing, done on the PlayStation 1.